Hey, what's up, turtles? It's Crick here with Black Owl Outdoors. And today I'm going to be doing a review on the hat I'm wearing. It's the Outdoor Research uh, Multicam Pocket Radar Cap, is what they're calling it. Comes in this multicam. I think there's some a uh, few other <clears throat> color options available. But uh, as uh, you know, patterns go, Stoney and I are huge fans of multicam because it's really a versatile camo. I'm not sure what it looks like with the background, but it's a really versatile type of camo that blends into a lot of different surrounding, um, excuse me, surroundings and your settings. As a, so as a one as a one type of camo goes, uh, multicam, multicam I really like. And this is uh, constructed out of a 50/50. This outer shell here it sort of looks like a ripstop to it. It's a 50% nylon and cotton. It has uh, a short sort of brim, this military style cap. And if you've seen a lot of my videos, I wear hats like this. When I'm in the canopy, I really just like the style of hat. It's a preference for me, personally. And what makes this sort of the radar, um, excuse me, the pocket cap, is that there's a little seam here actually in the brim. Picking that up, Sony. And what that allows it to do is I can fold the brim then and literally just roll this hat up really small. And you know, into the size that it is now, and even smaller. And this really will stuff into my pocket, and that's really cool. And you know, I was sort of apprehensive about how this might wear on my head when I put it on. If the brim will look funky, but it doesn't. I like the way you know it works. It's effective for everything, all that good stuff. And this is rated to, I think, a UPF, UPF 30. Inside, there's um, this is a completely synthetic layer to keep your scalp a little bit. Uh, off of the outer layer, potentially, if the sun's going to hit it, made a little little uh, layer of air to help. And a little bit of a hook right here, probably hanging up to dry. And this black that's probably showing up really contrasted in this, this is a, it's a synthetic band that goes the whole way around it. It actually acts as like a wicking layer. So as I sweat on the around my head, on my crown, this is going to keep it from coming down on my face on the brow, you know has that wicking te uh, texture material or technology that we've seen a lot of different synthetics and blends which I really like for this hat because honestly right now the temperature is probably close to 90 degrees the relative humidity is projected to be over 50 and it is freaking gross out it's beautiful to be out here you can probably hear a lot of the birds chirping it's a really calm day in the sense of you know the forest alive and it feels really cool but it's really really humid and just a little bit of activity you just have sweat sweat coming down and that's why I chose a hat like this in the canopy I don't need it for a sun hat I wouldn't use it for a sun hat if I was in, in you know direct sunlight but since I'm in the canopy I like it to wear a cap all the time because if there's ticks or there's insects coming off of trees I'm walking in a lot of brush it keeps them off my scalp you know like I said keeps the brow or uh, keeps sweat coming from down my, in, in my face when I'm hiking or walking and I like this hat because It'll sort of function for a lot of different things for me. I do a lot of different activities outside, and not just in the forest. But you know, I could I would wear this hat to go for a run, or or, or you know, ride my bike in the street, city, or out on a trail in here. Um, you know, skateboard. It, I think the style is fine enough to wear out for a casual uh, dinner potentially. Uh, you know, so like I guess I like this hat because it's just going to be able to do a lot of things because it's synthetic. I'm still able to dump some heat from my head, which is a really hot spot for us as as you know, our thermal regulation goes, a lot of heat is lost through the head. And when it's really hot out, you want heat to be able to leave your head. If I was wearing a wool hat right now, it'd be so much hotter. Um, so that's why I'm choosing to wear this style of hat now, this lighter synthetic, out in these hot, humid, hot, humid Pennsylvania summer days. But this is the multicam from Outdoor Research. You can see the style. I've already done a review on the, the, the Helios sun hat with them. It's also a multicam. So if you, if you like the multi-cam bike outdoor research, you can check out that video as well on their sun hat. It's Crick signing out with Black Outdoors. Later, turtles.